Let's talk about how to handle joint accounts right after the separation when you're about to face the beginning stages of a divorce. You still have bills, cell phone bills, rent, gas, insurance payments. Can I maintain those using funds from the joint account? I'll caution you, every situation is different and it's important to speak with an attorney before you make any final judgments here. But in general, I'll tell you, if you have a joint account in the course of your marriage you are using that to draw funds to pay your daily living expenses, then it's okay to give notice and take up to half of that account to use for your basic living expenses. I would encourage you, however, to put that into a separate account and keep a detailed ledger of the expenses. Oftentimes when you draw post-separation from a joint account, it's okay, but you're going to need to keep an accurate record and account for what was spent. Was it truly needed or was it vengeful spending, silly consumer debt that the other side may have a problem with? So for instance, you can't drain the account and buy the sports car, but you can use the account to maintain your lifestyle to make ends meet. But if it's frivolous consumer debt, you might be held accountable for that and your property will be divided giving you a lesser percentage to account for that frivolous waste of the joint account. So definitely use the joint account as necessary for your basic living, but be very careful and be, understand that you're under scrutiny here. So keep a detailed ledger and meet with your attorney to make sure you're in the right before proceeding.